good. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention as well. So I think I'm not sure. I've not weighed myself yet. I got to weigh myself at the end of the week. But I think I've lost quite a bunch of weight at the moment because on that Friday just gone, I was able to wear my jeans, which I haven't been able to wear the entire flipping lockdown. And fair enough, they weren't the loosest they've ever been. Usually when I wear them, they're quite baggy. And these times they kind of looked a bit like skinny jeans on the thighs, but still I was able to wear them. And I probably stretched them in that respect. But, you know, I had to kind of, you know, change up my outfits because I've been wearing the same all black outfit the entire lockdown because I didn't really have anything else I fit. And I refused to buy anything new that's i think the key to me personally i guess because i'm quite shallow and because i care about fashion and i like to look good um and i like to you know put together cool outfits and shit and whatnot and show out a bit i tend to kind of be a little bit more strict on myself or harder myself when it comes to putting on weight and working out and because i generally do enjoy working out too it makes it easy because i think you're probably you know it, inside of me i'm definitely an idiot i'm definitely a, uh, there's definitely a fat kid inside of me screaming you know every time i pick up a salad or i walk past a flipping tray of croissants you know what i mean it's for sure um it's definitely in there um but obviously those other things are, are far more important in my life you know what i mean looking good in clothes and being able to i don't know club all day and all that stuff i, I, I enjoy more so I, I kind of in my head make a decision okay cool i'm gonna i'm gonna sacrifice the donuts so i can go out three days in a week or i'm gonna sacrifice this so i can put on that jacket you know i mean it's a weird thing but you know we've all got our things so with that in mind i think another key thing as well that i tend to always do that i don't really i've only kind of realized now that might be a good solution is that if i do end up putting up on a bit of pounds which i haven't really in a long time i think i was probably at my lightest before lockdown i think i was about at the moment i'm gonna guess i haven't weighed myself yet but i'm gonna guess i'm probably like 250 240 pounds right which might be about i don't know what is that let me get on my calculator because I think before lockdown, if I'm not mistaken, I was probably, no, I was probably, I was around, so you say pounds wise, right? So at the moment, if, let's say I'm probably 250 at, to be, to be safe estimate, which is about 113 kilograms, which is what else do people use here? Stone, which is about uh, 17 stone, whatever. Anyway, that's what people use, right? They use kg and whatever, right? So yeah, I'm about 250 pounds, right? before lockdown that was 2020 february when i went to Berghain last um i was about 20 220 i'm definitely about 220 because i remember i fit in into everything everything was quite baggy so so i was about 99 kg um right at, th at that time 220 but my lightest of course at the beginning of no the end of 2019 i was definitely around the 200 mark so i kind of put on maybe 20 pounds within that year but it was a good 20 pounds because i was lifting a lot do you know what i mean it wasn't stuff that was making me not fit into clothes it was just stuff i was making my t-shirts maybe fit a little bit tighter which i would much prefer but one of the things that i definitely think really helps me in my weight loss in general is that i'd never ever go out and buy fat clothes like or fatter clothes the clothes that are the size that i'm getting into i have some clothes that i can i can fit into that you know will um accommodate that size that i put on but i never go out and buy like a full wardrobe you know like you know bigger pants but no i won't do it i'd rather just wear my i'd rather just wear the clothes that were baggy on me when i was skinnier and have them be tight on me then go out and wear those kind of you know i mean I, i'm just not gonna do it my brain just can't handle it and i think that's what helps because then you, you can't invest into a new wardrobe you have to wear what you have in your wardrobe already but you can't fit in it so then you only push to working out and then of course the other benefit also with that is that i'm working remotely or people are working from home from home most of the time so you don't have to go to work so you don't actually have to buy a new outfit you can basically just wear pajamas and stuff at home and you're perfectly fine so that really helps with the thing but i'm really happy man i'm so proud of myself that i did it i, I knew i was going to do it anyway it's nothing to really be super proud about and kind of give myself a pat on the back i was always going to achieve that thing like i said i'm super shallow and i, and I love fashion so that was always going to happen i was definitely going to ensure that i was a size that would permit me to wear the things i want to wear when i go out and it's weird too because it's only when i want to go out clubbing and stuff that i want to wear this stuff because you know where else am i gonna go so that's been a pretty deep revelation so I'm, i think i'm down to i'm gonna weigh myself to the end of this week but i think i'm about 250 i think so the last time i weighed myself i was 260 i think the heaviest during covid i was like 280 which is nuts and it was well, what's 280 <laughs> 280 during covid you could probably see it in a podcast episode from like from like the time from like to, if you look back at like an episode from like 2020 like early 2020 like january and then you skip all the way to like 2021 you'll definitely see a big difference um so yeah i was about 220 which was about 220 pounds which was about 127 kg back then now i'm probably about 250 so i think i probably lost about 30 pounds and then hopefully by the end or the beginning of october when i plan to go oh, at the end of october no you say beginning of october when i plan to sober october and then at the beginning of november when i plan to go to Berghain, 
I'm definitely going to be around the 200 mark. That's the, that's the plan. Do you know what I mean? Really about the 200, maybe 210 mark. I definitely want to get there because, you know, why not? It's just good to kind of try to get yourself down to a shape or to a size that you haven't had before. See how it feels and then work your way up. I think in general, my work, my walking weight should be 220. I think that's where I kind of sit tight. Mm, 210, 220 is my walking weight. I can I can live within those margins. The moment it gets into about the 230 mark, it gets a bit frisky. I've been 190 before. I didn't like how it fit my body. I think my head's just too big for that kind of size I probably have to fill out a bit more muscular wise and if I want to be a 190 but I just don't like like the way my head looks it makes my head look way too bigger than what it should look on my body but still um you know let's stick up 200 gang in it so I've still got a bit a bit of way to go still got about 50 pounds to lose but I'm happy I'm on my way slowly getting there clothes are starting to fit a little bit more looser I don't feel like I'm gonna rip everything when I'm wearing it you know it's just it's just a whole new world you know what I mean a whole new world so now when I when you see me out and that I'm not gonna just be in all black because all black is usually a sign that I'm feeling a little bit fat so if I'm able to wear co colors it's definitely a good sign man but I'll probably go back to all black stuff anyway because what more talking about Jimmy I love wearing all black man every time I, most of the times I've been to fold or I've been to like the cores and stuff I've been head to toe in black looking like a bouncer you know what I mean bomber jacket you know jumper t-shirt everything black 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 all the way down or I'll just spice it up and have like some colourful underwear or socks or something but you know we do what we do with the things that we have available man but yeah that, that, that's where I'm at that's where I'm at with the weight journey that's where I'm at